This is a quick video to show you Quake running on a PyStorm 32 Lite. This PyStorm has a Py4 in it and is completely passively cooled. Uh, it's running in my standard Amiga 1200 really. Now I'm going to run a time demo on Quake uh, for demo 1. Um, this is running at 320 by 240 resolution and we will see the results. <laughs> As we can see here, we're getting 92 frames per second, which is pretty impressive. But this is the 320 by 240, so let's kind of ramp things up and put it at 640 by 480 and see what we get. That is still at a very playable 43 frames per second. I'm sure we could get this higher if I used some active cooling and overclocked the device, but quite frankly, this is pretty damn good. So how about if we switch from using RTG graphics to AGA graphics? I will uh, switch everything up and uh, change the capture device. This time we're running at a standard 320 by 200 resolution, which is somewhat normal for an Amiga. I could actually run this at 320 by 240 and I think 320 by 256 is the other resolution that it'll let you run in the AGA mode. Let's see what the time demo produces. <laughs> That's a whole uh, 47 frames per second, which is pretty nice as well. Definitely uh, makes the game quite playable. Um, with that, I'll leave you with uh, some more footage of Quake running on the AGA. Oh. Thank <laughs> you. 